going to be cutting pipe. I'm going to show you how to do a 90 degree angle cut. That way you cut a piece and it does a nice fish mouth at a 90 degree angle. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you guys some of the don't do's. And this is why we're going to learn how to cut pipe at a 90 degree angle. I'm going to show you how to not do this or this. Instead, we're going to be doing a wicked miter cut that I've learned to do a perfect notch for a fish mouth. This is for a 90 degree angle. This is how my feet looks. And yeah, this is how we notch or how we cut pipe with a grinder. And it's going to stay at a 90 degree angle. We're doing this cut with a grinder. Measuring tape, piece of paper, ruler, pencil. Safety glasses and our gloves. First thing you want to do is make sure that our paper wraps around our pipe. Let's go ahead and mark them, measure it, remove the excess. Now I'm going to go ahead and get the diameter of my pipe, mark it on my paper, and then I'm going to go ahead and trace my line. Now I'm going to fold my paper in half, make sure it's nice and flush, perfect, and after that I'm going to fold it in half one more time. For instructional purposes, I'm going to be marking the lines just so you can see where it is I'm going to measure to and from. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit the like, smash that subscribe. If you guys want to help out the channel, just subscribe, drop a comment. Don't forget to go to coinsywelds.com. I do have merch available. Here I am marking the lines like I was telling you just a little while ago. I'm marking where half of the pipe is. So my pipe diameter is two and a half. So my radius is one and a quarter. And I'm marking that now. Then I'm gonna go ahead and make a solid line all the way through. And in my papers, when the folds, I'm gonna go ahead and do a diagonal marks from the corners to the dots. And you'll see right now what I mean by it. And don't get frustrated if you don't get it on your first try. It took me maybe a few a few times to master it. And once you get it, you'll be able to just go ahead and notch or, you know, cut pipe at any given degrees. I'll show you how to do 45s, 90s, and how to notch corners perfectly. As you can see, now I'm tracing the, the, my folds from the corners to the dots. And then after that, I'm going to go ahead and cut it. You need to cut it, and then that's pretty much making a template. And that's what's going to be where I'm going to be tracing on my pipe. And then I'll be going ahead and cutting off with my grinder. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and trace it. Nice, solid lines. Remember, it's going to be your guideline so you could go ahead and cut it. So you have a YouTube, so you get a 90 degree angle with a fish mouth pipe every time.
We'll do that. Next, I'll show you how to do a 45 degree cut.